YouTube. Like and subscribe. Now. We're making what, Maya? We're making, have you guys seen smash potatoes? No. So these little ones, uh, I'm gonna boil and then we're gonna put them on this uh, baking sheet and then smash them down with like the bottom of a cup and then put cheese on top of them and bake them again so they get really crispy. Wait, Maya, I actually have, a, I, I've had the most delicious type of potato recently. Okay. It's a mashed potato. Oh my God, wait, holy shit, it might be what you're describing. It's like a mashed potato. <laughs> You're dumb, man. Are you good? <laughs> Dude, I'm kind of fucked up right now. I'm not going to lie. Okay, wait, wait. It's like a mashed potato, but then it's crispy on the outside. So you could like pick it up, but it's a mashed potato. It's like almost like a deep fried mashed potato. Wow. I've been ordering it from this one sushi place, and I don't know why they have it. Because it's a sushi place. And I get Otoro from there. And I told Andy, I was like, yeah, I've been ordering Otoro. And he's like, how much are you paying for a piece? And I told him, and he was like... You're fucking idiot, Rich! And he was like, nice tattoo! And he's just making fun of me. <laughs> I don't have any friends. It's kind of like, this is the cowbell of cooking. Yeah. Rich, have you ever met a cow in person? Wow, I almost made a really mean joke about... Don't say about who. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine, LSF would like me today. <laughs> Shit! <laughs> yeah. You know what we should start doing every time we stream together, Maya? What? A counter for how many times I pissed you off. A counter? Well, that was just rude. That was kind of rude. That was really rude. Could you apologize, please? That looks good. Could you apologize? No. Wow, watch this. <laughs> <laughs> Temperatures. Jesus Christ. Chat, I like to heat my apartment. Okay, oh. you might think this is crazy. It's like a sauna in here. I like to heat my apartment at 73. What the fuck? 72 sometimes. I just like it. You know, you know the cold makes you more intelligent. I mean, think faster. So maybe you like the heat because it slows down your brain. Because you're thinking too much all the time. So you might like the heat because it lulls you lulls you to like a, a lower state of thinking. Oh. You guys know how I've been talking about buying a goat? Here's, okay, I'll explain. So I do, uh, I do, um, I have two goats and I do, they're pack goats or they're meant to be pack goats. Um, but they're very small. They're like uh, 40 pounds each, they're little. 
And so, and they can carry like 20% of their weight. And I have two, and one of them, we're 3D printing a harness so she can cameraman um, on the trail. So she's, she's gonna have a GoPro, so she got a commission for carrying. Um, and then my other goat can still pack, but that means that my max carrying capacity for my team is like eight pounds of weight, <laughs> which uh, just isn't, uh, it's just not, I, I just need a little more, you know what I mean? Oh. So, I was talking, I was thinking about getting a, I was thinking about getting another goat, and getting a pack goat, so like, whereas my goats are 40 pounds right now, if you don't want to know, they're 40 pounds, um, I was going to get a goat that was, uh, like 200 to 250 pounds. <laughs> um, the biggest goat that I've ever had was 180 pounds. And he was pretty big. But, anyway, I talked to a guy this morning, um, I talked to a guy this morning about, about the goats, and he's got a, a ranch in Idaho, and telling me about how I can come out there, come out there and pick them, but, and then he's talking about how people come from all over the country, you know, to this ranch. Um, and get goats, and so I was like, oh, I didn't know it was such a big operation, like, what's, so I, I wanted to know the scope of the operation. Is it rude? I asked, I said, how many kids do you sell a year? Like, how many baby goats do what you sell a year? What the fuck are you talking about? Oh, oh, oh Jesus Christ. No, baby goats. Baby goats are called kids. Sorry, 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 sorry. Okay, but I'm actually asking, is that rude? For, in, for any, for any reason? To ask that? Because you were saying how, like, people travel across the country like, to get them, I don't feel like it would be. I can't think of a reason, except you never want to ask a farmer, like, how many head of cattle do you have? Because that's, like, asking how much money you have. Oh, but, really? Yeah, and I guess maybe it's kind of like that. But he was just like, oh, I don't disclose that information. It's a super professional operation. And I was like, what? <laughs> what do you mean? Like, I don't know what I said. Um, Are you buying goats? Uh, I, yeah, I'm trying. I actually know a guy. I wouldn't ask that. I just wanted to know how, what the scope of his operation was. I don't know. You know a guy that has goats? I know the goat. Skump. Seth Abner. Who? Seth Skump Abner. The goat. Who's that? Literally the king. The cod god. Dude, what did he do the other day? This is a genuine question. I. I checked my phone and my entire timeline was like at scum holy shit the fucking king and I, I actually tweeted at him I was like dude what the fuck did you just do but there's no way he saw it you, you know what's wild I was walking around with Emily in, in New York and we walked past like a sunglass shop it was like Oakley or something and it was just a giant picture of Scump's face and it was like all Oakley branded. I was like, Emily, do you know who that is? And she was like, no. I hate her. What? <laughs> yeah, Emily's really cool, actually. She is cool. Yeah. I'm going to Miami with her and Slick. This really? Week. Yeah. How do I do this? Like, zigzag? I want, I want the yolk to disintegrate, right? I want to denature the protein. Do you believe in alchemy? Uh, I don't know. Do you know what alchemy is? Mm -hmm. Basically, it's the law of equivalent exchange. Okay. You can't get something out of nothing. So, in theory, w with alchemy, we could, we could turn this into anything. We could turn this into gold. That doesn't make sense. But what's... What's the value of a human soul? The great taboo of alchemy, Maya. Don't try it. Don't try it. Full metal Maya. <laughs> yeah, I feel like Maya's a latent, or like not, no, a nascent weeb. What? I feel like you're a nascent weeb. What does that mean? Like, you're like a, 
like a splinter cell. You're like a uh, you're like an agent waiting to be awoken by the Soviet government. Like I feel like if you saw the right anime, you would become like the biggest weeb ever. I um, see that in you. I disagree. You know, have you ever watched like uh, have you ever watched Vinland Saga? You would like that one. You're a lot like the main character. Why? Uh, guys, don't you think don't you think she's a lot like Thorfinn? <laughs> like low key, <laughs> low key. Did you like it? I... I don't know. It's way overrated! Dude, it was good, but there were way too many things that pissed me off for me to leave that show being like, that was a good show. So here's the thing with the show. Credit to all of the actors, they were all incredible. It was shot very well. It was, you could throw any like fourth grade written script on that with that cast. And the way that it was shot, it would at least be appealing to watch. But the actual story is dog shit. Really? Fucking dog shit. Well, I, don't, I actually it, think the concept is really neat. It, 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 it's so, it's so, so. You want to know a good life or the game? Now that's a fucking movie. The game. You guys ever see that? The other reason I didn't really like Squid Game is like, it, like, they followed the characters really well, which I really liked. But it got to the point where I was watching it and you knew it wasn't exciting anymore because you knew who was going to die every time. Because it's yeah. like, this one's developing, this one's not. It was so obvious. The, ri oh, the writing wasn't good. Mm. Yeah, you, you kind of are like it. You're, you're, you are a Thorfinn. I don't know what that means. Don't you guys think Mai is kind of a Thorfinn? <laughs> Arcane? I didn't watch it. A bunch of my friends have, though. I feel like I'm betraying Dota if I watch it. Can you freestyle? No. Let's try. No. What are you going to do to beat? I'm not going to freestyle. <laughs> wow. It sounded like you were tagging a building. You're really getting in the spirit. Alright, let's do it. One time I almost tagged a building in high school. Distribute yeah. that between these two. I've never done that. I don't believe you. Do you think I've committed crimes? Yes. I think chat thinks I'm like a, a pretty nerdy, non-criminal human being. I don't know why you would think otherwise. He walked in my apartment this morning, asked if there were lines of cocaine on my dining room table, and then snorted my matcha. What the fuck? That's not even true. How old are you? Why you just really hurt my feelings right I now? I just, I forgot. Uh, also, never mind. You know how old I am. No, I, I actually don't remember. Are you want to guess? I think that'd be worse. Guess. <laughs> Are you sure? Yeah. 29? That was very nice of you. you. You're not 30. I just turned 30. Oh, really? Yeah, my birthday was September. Wait, did I say happy birthday? No, actually. Damn. Yeah, you didn't. There's no way. Your birthday, you missed my birthday completely. No way. Mm -hmm. You sure? Yeah, like a hundred percent sure. You didn't say a single thing. I like don't believe you. You didn't text me nothing. It's fine. It's not a big deal. A lot of people forgot actually. It's kind of crazy how many people forgot. Like ugh, pretty much everybody forgot this year, and it was like my my biggest birthday ever the most years and nobody said shit and and somebody who at the time i hardly knew said i'm not gonna let you be alone on your birthday and uh we went out and we got one drink in, in brooklyn and that was my birthday because this birthday was probably one of my hardest birthdays considering that you know I think you're right. I don't see. Yeah, my, my ex girlfriend had just broken up with me right before my, you know, the big three go, and you know, he didn't say anything. Damn. Yeah. It's always next year, huh? Hopefully. It, it, September 6th rolls around, and I, I, I'll make it to 31. 
No, it's fine though. It's a shit birthday anyway. Now it's time to start lying about how old I am. I think I, I think I lie up. I think I'm in an awkward. I'm in the doldrums. You're older than thirty. Yeah, because I like at that point, like if I tell people I'm fifty, they'll be impressed. But if I tell people I'm thirty, they're like, I'm sorry. No one's gonna believe that you're fifty. Chad, I'm fifty. Look at my hairline. I don't even think you realize that. Though. Thank you, Maya. That was the birthday gift I needed. You're Just a little bit late. No, oh, that's actually kind of fucked. What? Uh, that you forgot? Yeah. No, you're fine. Well, I, I, mean, I was just kidding. I, I wasn't I here. I wasn't here. Yeah, because I do not know when your birthday is. I don't know when your birthday is. Yes. Yes? Yeah. Like, based off of how you act? Sure, I, yeah. Mmm. Okay. You're very grounded. I think you're an earth sign. Uh, Jesus Christ. I've been hanging out with Emily. Oh, is she into that? She's into that. Yeah. Uh, she's into a lot of things. Uh, okay, so I think you're an earth sign. But you have like a little bit of a... Uh, I feel like you're very passionate about a lot of the things that you do. So maybe you're a cusp. Maybe you're earth cusp fire. Uh, March 28th. Oh, was I close? That would have been crazy. That would have been crazy. Uh, uh, mm -hmm. May. May. May, yeah. <laughs> right, that's why. Yep. Yeah. May. Yep. 14th. Nope. May 22nd. Damn close. 23rd. Damn close. 24th. Yes. Wow, I knew it. That's kind of crazy. Honestly, I'm kind of impressed with the, that guessing. That didn't take very many guesses. Where's my soft? I didn't even look at chat. I actually didn't look at chat. Where's my soft? Huh. I looked at chat and the first thing I saw was your birthday and the second thing I saw was Rich Baldo Mega Lol. Okay. Number one, get to re royale. Yeah, Fortnite, we about to get down. get down. Ten kills on the board right now. Just wipe down.